In the Battle of Ahzab, Sayyidina Ali bin Abi Talib took on the legendary Amru bin Abdul Wood. It was almost like a David versus Goliath battle. Sayyidina Ali bin Abi Talib, however, skillfully managed to floor Amru bin Abdul Wood. And just as he was about to deal the final blow, Amru bin Abdul Wood spat on his face. Instead of continuing with the blow, Sayyidina Ali bin Abi Talib walked away from that scene. Eventually, of course, he will defeat Amru bin Abdul Wood. But the companions asked Sayyidina Ali bin Abi Talib why, at the point of time where when he managed to floor Amru bin Abdul Wood, that he did not follow up with a strike, after, especially after he spat on his face. And Sayyidina Ali bin Abi Talib said, I do everything for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and I want to get the full reward. I worry that if I react to him spitting on my face, then the anger from within myself will tarnish my intentions. Which is why I walked away from that. Now, one of the things that we can learn from this is that when we do good, we sometimes fail to realize that we are most spiritually vulnerable. Because we are doing something good and we, feel, we might feel entitled to all the good things that will come with it. This is when we can be rather unguarded. And if things don't work out our way when we are doing good, that's when all these intentions will start to show. If we are doing good, what if someone reacts negatively to us? What if someone hurls abuse to us? How will we react? Will we also in return, as a form of exchange, also hurl abuse to that person who abused us in the first place? Why? Because we feel so entitled and justified because we are the ones who are doing good. And therefore, since we are doing good, all good, all things that come after that can be justified. It is therefore important for us to bear in mind that apart from having the right intentions, the actions that come after it must be right as well. We can't have the right intentions follow up with the wrong actions. It's like a beautiful painting. A single blotch on it will spoil the whole beautiful picture. It is therefore very important for us to set the right intentions like how we have in our mindset a beautiful picture and carefully start to draw, paint because the more careful we are, the least likely we are to have blotches on our painting and therefore we will be able to present a beautiful picture that we can enjoy.